Yo, what's going on? It's your boy, Miles Cunningham. Shout out to Lucario. Shout out to all the supporters. Shout out to everybody on the Bad Boy membership. Shout out to everybody on the Patreon, the Bad Boy show, and the Confidence show. Go to MrLucario.com. Check out our products, but definitely get the book, How to Have Sex with Two Women a Day. Get your t-shirts. I'm God to these hoes. Submissive women are sexy and binary as fuck. Shout out to everybody who calls in on the live stream. Who asks questions. Really appreciate you guys. Shout out to everybody that donates. Really appreciate you guys. You guys keep the show going so we can keep the game flowing. All right. So today, what I want to talk about is the three things a woman must earn from a man. The three things a woman must earn from a man. Those three things are time, energy, and resources. The three things a woman must earn from a man. Must earn. They have to earn it. Time, energy, and resources. Material resources. So, reason why I'm talking about this is that <clears throat> a lot of guys get caught up in giving giving their time, giving their energy, and giving their resources to a woman for absolutely no reason. They and they they get this from you for free. So you know, for you guys that do online dating, you. You know, you you match with a chick and you're texting her back and forth or you got a you got a chick at work. You got that one chick in your class or that one chick that, you know, and you're texting her and you're trying to talk to her and you're back and forth, back and forth. And it's like she's getting your time for free. Like this is this is why we, we, we talk so much about setting up the date as soon as as soon as possible. This is why we talk about getting together with the with the girl as soon as possible. You cannot allow these chicks to get your time, energy and and resources for free. You can't allow them to get anything without earning it. <clears throat> Females are opportunists by nature. Anything that they receive, if they don't have to earn it, they will not view it as important. If they don't have to earn it, they will not view it as important. They won't respect it. They won't add any value to it. You understand? And this is why this is why she has to earn it. This is why you have to set up a date. This is why she has to do she has to do some type of action. She has to speak she has to speak to to the language the natural language of a man which is action by going out on a date. She got to get dressed, she got to meet you where you said to meet. She has to follow some type of protocol directed by you. She has to give you some sort of action based indication that she's willing to submit to some extent or at least follow some type of direction to explore possibilities of her being a part of your frame being a part of your life and showing that she's willing to earn your time energy and resource do you understand what i'm saying like these this is something that we have to keep in the forefront of our mind because a lot of us are willing to give up to give up time energy and resources just because a female is attractive to us just because a female looks a certain way like we we must understand that a female's looks is not is not anything that she is not anything is not has nothing to do with any effort that she put out And and a woman just looking good for example, on Instagram or on the internet, or even like at a at a at a social in a social setting, right? You you just roll up to a chick and fucking offer to buy her a drink. You're you're providing her resources and attention for absolutely nothing. Cause the reason why the date, setting up the date and her meeting you on a date is so important is because to some extent, she's Putting out that effort directly for you. 
Do you understand? You understand when you set up the date, you tell her the time and place to meet you and she meets you at that time and place. There's an indication that she's doing it specifically for you. But just seeing someone in a social setting and and offering to buy them a drink just because you thought they looked nice. That's you already putting yourself in a subservient position. That's you already showing her that you're willing to give up your resources for absolutely no type of effort on her part. So these things you, you, you got to be careful about. You have to you have to you know, even if you even if you meet someone somewhere, you don't offer her anything. You get her information and then you try to set up a meeting at a later date. Or if you meet her in in a social setting. You ask you ask you ask her to leave the leave that setting with you to go to a new place. You understand? Or or say, hey, you know, I want to talk to you. Let's go outside where it's quiet. And if she's in and she has to indicate that she's willing to follow your direction, that she's willing to invest some type of effort and action to follow your lead, follow your direction, because. Whatever she's doing, she's doing it specifically for you. You have to th that that indication has to be met before you can give give up any of your time, energy and material resource. You understand what I'm saying? So this is what this is why this is why we talk about escalating. This is why we talk about setting up the date. This is why we talk about all these things. All these things become necessary. You know, a popular a popular idea going around these days is that, you know, she's for the streets. And that's true. Most of these females are for the streets. You know, most pussy is community pussy. You feel me? But that saying comes from another saying that goes, she's not yours. It's just your turn. But that's that's the important part right there. If it's your turn, it got to be your turn. That means. When it's your turn, she's ready to listen to your instructions, your directions. She's willing to to submit to some extent to, to what you're doing, your agenda, your program. You understand what I'm saying? So these things, these things have to be have to be at the at the forefront before you can start to spend time, energy and resources on a female. You understand? These are things that a female must earn. And, and how does she earn that? She she has to listen. She has to follow instruction. She has to show up. She has to and she has to have respect. She has to have respect. The first thing the first thing that she has to um, display is respect. You understand? She don't forget the whole being attracted to you and shit that that we could we could work on that later. You understand? We could we could use our charm and our humor and you know, different parts of our personality to make that shit happen. But the first part is respect. So that's why when you, you set up the date, you want her to show up on time. You want her like if you had if you mentioned to her that you like you like for her to dress a certain way. She followed that instruction. You understand what I'm saying? Like, see, the, these things are important because <clears throat> what I've noticed in my experience is that anytime you tell a woman something and she tries to switch it up or she tries to change something, like if you if you tell her to meet you someplace and she's like, oh, well, I don't like that place. Can we meet here? Or she says some shit like, oh, um, you know, I don't want to meet at that time. Can we meet at this time? Pretty much every single fucking time I get any type of resistance or friction based on the instructions that I've given the female and she tries to switch it up. It's 99, 99.99 times out of 100. It, I always got to charge the bitch. Always. Always. It's like, it's, 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 trust me, bro. It's, it's like clockwork, man. It's like clockwork. When the bitch don't want to fucking submit to your instruction, you, you, she has to get charged. She has to get charged because she's already showing you that, yeah, yeah, I'm for the streets, but it's, it's, I'm still on some shit. Like it's still everybody else's turn. She, she don't have that, that level of respect to show you that it's your turn. Meaning that it's your turn for me to submit. It's your turn for, for, for me to earn your energy, attention, and resource and your time. You see what I'm saying? These are things that, that, that a female has to, has to indicate to you early on for you, to, for you to move forward with anything. Because, I mean, the proof of the importance of a man's time, energy, and resource, all you got to do is look around and you see that shit. You understand? You, any... any 
just look around. You see roads, you see stores, you see fucking, you know, though everything that you see all around you is a, is a man's time, energy and resource, you know, cars, fucking, you know what I'm saying? Civilization, skyscrapers, money, every fuck, pretty much every fucking thing you see. Like I told you in a previous video, we are masters of, we are masters of the fucking universe. This is, this is what we do. So you have to, you have to really look at it and consider my time, energy, and resource is the most important thing. So a female has to earn it no matter what stage of the game we're at. If, whether I'm just saying hi and I'm meeting you someplace or we're on online dating or if I meet you in a social circle, you have to show that you're willing to submit to some extent. You have to show you have to show some type of willingness to follow my agenda. You understand what I'm saying? So keep those things in mind when you're when you're dealing with females and, and you and I, I know that you'll. You'll carry yourself differently and, and you'll you'll put a woman in a, in a position where she has to take certain things seriously in order to get anything from you. And that's what's most important. All right. So, again, check out the T-shirts, check out the bad boy membership. Go to UndeniableGame.com to get that free program. You know, check us out on Patreon. We got the bad boy show and the confidence show. All right. So it's your boy, Miles Cunningham. Always remember the truth is inside you. Peace.